今日の成功は全て君がいたから起きたことなんだ。Let's set off an age. After a few days of rain, Sally is finally welcomed a sunny morning on the weekend. You and Atom came to an orphanage in the suburbs for a written visit legal consultation. This is pretty far out. When you're this far from the hustle and bustle of the city, even the air seems to smell sweeter. Oh, I kept forgetting to ask, how do you know the manager of this orphanage? She made a whole it's so than a whole not a tokini, she did it under. Zai san no jizo ni cancer is to moya, whole it's there a tie show dekina in Monday nado no so than o ketena. Oh, like what? Go it tie sets near me, say, and shall walk her. Do she here? 頼れる家族がいないことを理由に入ってくるんだが中には親族がいて正当な理由がないにもかかわらず扶養を拒否されてしまう子がいるんだそれで園長はどうしてこれが扶養義務放棄に当たらないのかと私に聞いてきたんだが Without a properly property inheritance agreement non immediate relatives aren't under any legal obligation to support a minor But their blood relatives, so for all, doing something like that makes them seem cold hearted. Holy to the Sagan de Kirinoa, Dotokno Saite Kijun Madede. Genji Tendua, Soreo Kairukoto a Tekinai. Okano Jido Yogo Set the Mo, Do Yo no Koto a Okite Rashi. So you can't help worrying about those kids when you come here to visit, huh? Atom nods and goes silent for some time. He then squeezes your hand tighter. The Sets of the Kodomo Tachua, Fukuzatana Kaken or Stay Rukara, Don and Dino Koto Krabete, Kangai Katana Kotona Tay Rukotonga Oi. Kokoro no Oksokodeva, Dareka ni Amai Taito Nengai, Gai Kaito no Tsunagari o Motome Tay Runoni, Sona Jibun o Hyogen Sur Kotonga Tekinai. Holy Tsuna, Karela no Subete o Tasker Kotonga Tekinai Ijo. 私にできることを代わりにしてあげたいんだ。Yeah, let's do it together from now on. そうか。つい最近、園長が音楽会を開くための資金援助を受けたと話していたから、私たちにできることを考えてみようか。A charity concert? ああ。私もニュースで知った程度だが、支援してくれたのは、最近海外から戻ってきたバイオリン奏者だそうだ。That's great! And if I like that, we'll live in up the orphanage and make the, the kids happier. 準備さえ済めば、私たちも一緒に楽しめるはずだ。You can't resist walking a bit faster after this new f o r m anticipation. Before you know it, the Angels of Stella's Orphanage appears before you. Angels of Stella's Orphanage. As you follow a staff member into the orphanage, you can't help feeling a sense of surprise. It's much quieter than you were expecting. There are no sounds of children whatsoever. Did something happen? <clears throat> something isn't right, and you look at Atom with a worried expression. He doesn't seem to know the reason either, so he only looks around calmly. <laughs> さっきの弁護士、ようこそアンジェル学園へ。An old man you've never seen before emerges from an office. His face somewhat exhausted. 吉野さん、お久しぶりです。Atom greets the old man politely when he comes out. He then looks over at you again. こちらはアンジェル学園の園長、吉野さんだ。こんにちはあなたのことは左京弁護士から何度も聞いていましたが<笑>ようやくお会いできましたねすみませんね
、えるのはるばるご足労いただいたのに、大したおもてなしもできませんで。何かお困りのことでもはいその通りですもともとこの話は向こうから提案してくれたもので資金援助だけでなく公園まで開いてくれると言われたんです子供たちもそれはそれは喜んで我々もなんていい人たちなんだろうと思っていたのですがある時寄付金の覚書はすでに書いたから先に会場と設備を手配してほしいと言われたんです公演が終わったら一括で清算するとそれでめったにない機会なのでうちとしても積極的に協力してきました子供たちも何一つ文句を言わず朝から晩まで掃除や準備をしてくれたんですなのにいざリハーサルが始まってその様子を撮影したかと思うとその日以降一切話が進まなくなって、really? Have you contacted them since then? もちろんしましたよでも何度も何度も連絡してようやく電話に出たかと思ったら「援助はもう済んだ」と言われ。あげく、まだ寄付が欲しいのかとまで言ってきたんです。一円たりとも寄付なんてしてないのに、どの口が。それなのに、テレビや新聞では寄付の話が美談として語られているんですよ。私たちに費用を肩代わりさせておいてね。正直に言って、困り果てています。縁に損失を与えてしまった上に、子供たちはずっと楽しみにしていて。お二人は、弁護士でしょう。何かいい方法はございませんか児童養護施設の経費は、個人の財産ではなく、全支出事項が国の監査対象となっていますよってそのような費用を園が負担する義務はありません覚書を交わし公共の場で寄付を約束したのであれば法律に沿って相手を提訴しかかった経費を要求することが可能です This incident... You raise your gaze to look at Autumn. He not slightly responding with a decisive yet warm smile. I think I'm going to say that. 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 I'm going to say t これ以上ご迷惑をおかけするのは大変忍びないのですがお二人の知り合いにバイオリンを弾ける方はいらっしゃらないでしょうか you mean... 子供たちのことは先ほどお話しした通りですせっかく頑張って用意してくれたのにこのまま終わりだなんてあんまりです私も年相応の貯金はしておりますので奏者さんさえ見つかれば音楽界を諦めずに済むかもしれません。The director is so earnest that you can't help but feel touched.You look at Atom expectantly. His guest responds to yours, but his expression is somewhat hesitant, like his words are struck in his throat. Does he already know someone who would be good for the role? 
Right, Artem has all kinds of clients from the different backgrounds. He must know some amazing violinists. わかりました。もし見つかった場合は、すぐにお伝えします。子供たちに代わって、感謝いたします。顔を上げてください。これも仕事の範囲内ですから。Atom lowers his head, pulls his phone out of his pocket, and glances at it. すみません。一度スケジュールを確認させてください。The director nods, turns out, and turns and walks back into his office. Atom takes your hand, and you both head back to the alley outside the orphanage. Outside orphanage. The alley is completely empty. You look at Atom when he stops, feeling yourself overflowing with anticipation. You know he already has a plan. Did you already think of someone? Tell me. In contrast to your eagerness, Atom is very calm. You mean. Me? You didn't learn how to play the violin before starting college, and Atom is aware of that. Ah, もちろん強要はしない。嫌ならこの場で断ってくれていい。So you didn't tell the director immediately earlier because. 私があの場で答えていたら、それこそ君は断れなくなるだろう。何度も言うが、強要はしたくないんだ。君の思ったままを聞かせてほしい。Of course I want to help. That way the biggest problem will already be solved. Even though I'm not as good as professional violinists, I can still play a few pieces. However, as soon as the words leave your mouth, you inevitably begin to feel a little nervous. But this performance isn't just an entertaining party, it represents all of Keith's expectations. Since I started working, I haven't played violin for a long time. How could I ever compare to a professional? The thought of standing alone on the stage as everyone watches you make you feel somewhat unpanic. Even so, you can't accept allowing the concert to be cancelled just because you refuse. So, I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. Even though I learned how to play a while ago, I've never performed in public, let alone for such an important event. なるほど。心配していたのはそこか。では、私のチェロと合奏ならどうだ私がいくらか視線をさらってしまうかもしれないが。Autumn, performing the cello. You look up and can't help feeling curious about how he'll look when he's performing on stage. Kimiga Simpai Stirinoa, Enso Kaiga Donaru Kanao Daro? De Areba, Kekka Watashi no Dorok Shide, Doto de Monar. Dakara Sumanega, Ichido Jibun no Kokoro ni Kite Mite Hoshi. Yoke na Koto a Kangaze, Shojikini. Atom reaches out and puts his hand on your shoulder. His gentle touch holds a steady on power. Do you think I can do a good job? Ah, Skunakto mo, watashi wa so shinjite iru. He speaks incredibly decisively, as if he is simply stating a natural fact. Watashi wa, bari yori mo kimi no yushu sa o shitte iru karana. To wa ye, ya hari, では戻って、ヨシオンさんと話すとしよう。音楽会の件も、訴訟関連のことも。
Facing the sun, you and Atom walk back to the orphanage. Every step you take with Dick with him puts you more and more at ease. Despite knowing that there will be challenges ahead, you don't want to fail, so you will simply try your best. At least he is with you. Celestine's Office The next day, you and Artem head to the firm and tell Celestine what happened at the orphanage and what you two have planned. Mata na no? Mese ga hoshi nara, damas nan te yarikata shi na kya ii no ni. Ageku kodomo tachi made liyo suru nan te. Ongaku kai o hiraku nara, watashi mo nakama ni irete. Isso no koto, temis de shusai shi chai masho. Chodo kyonen no junri eki kara dashita, enjo shikin ga nokotte ta kara, iro iro to tsugo ga ii wa. Just like Celestine, she's as reliable as ever. Jimmy's enjoy scheme was for the protection of the family. Other things are better to be kept away. Above all, the team is willing to share their efforts with the organization. How about this charity event? Yes, that's right. 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 一石二鳥だ<笑>もうそこまで考えてたのねいいわその方向で行きましょう証拠集めの協力と資金繰りは私に任せておいてその分肝心の音楽会の方はそっちでお願いね何よりも大事にすべきは施設の子供たちの方だから。Autumn nods, then hands Celestine a document you two put together last night. This is the plan of the plan. Let me give you a second. Celestine takes the document and scans it line by line. She nods as she reads but suddenly stops, her eyes widening in surprise. Sakyo-kun? There's a song of cello, but I'm wrong with my mistake. She looks back down at the document in her hand a few more times. Her gaze flits between you and Arthur before she takes a meaningful pause. Ah, violin wa nata ga tanto suru no ne. Sore nara nattoku da wa. Hmm, liokai. Teikei saki kara ii henji o moratta ra, ato wa uchi no tanto sha ni mawashite oku wa ne. Thank you, Celestine. いいのよそれじゃ二人の合奏を楽しみにしてるわアトムスホームティーターアトムスホームティーター has been specially soundproof even if you play instruments inside you won't end up disturbing his neighbors After you get off work, Artem heads back to your place with you to pick up your violin. You then head to his home teacher to practice together. I practiced in so long. I'm pretty rusty. Don't慌てなくていい。時間をかけて思い出せばいいだけだ。まずは指の使い方と音感に意識を集中して、それが整ってきたら曲の練習に入ろう。It's as if Atom's voice is magic, and it calms you down right away. You stop what you are doing to watch him. His cello needs to be retuned, so he gently turns the peaks on the scroll, adjusting the tension of the strings to find the right tone. Hey Atom, I never asked. Why did you start learning how to play the cello? Atom's hand slows down somewhat. His gaze unconsciously shifts down and off to the side, as if he is staring at a distant memory. Live your spirits. あの時は本格的に法律を学び始めたばかりで、自分が身につけた能力にうぬぼれていてな。法律の条文を使って事件を分析するようにどんなことに対しても絶対的な理性で判断するようになっていたんだ
そんな折に先輩から白と黒だけでは世界は割り切れない時には感性で物事を見る必要もあると言われ絶対的な理性を芸術的な感性で中和してみろと楽器を勧められたんだ What that upperclassman said kind of makes sense. He pauses, seemingly thinking over what he said. もちろん始めた理由は他にもあって私は単純にチェロの素朴で限りのある音が気に入ってなそうして続けているうちにチェロが趣味の一つになったんだ My God is telling me it's not just an amateur hobby. Atom continues tuning the instrument. Even though it already sounds perfect to you, he is still somewhat hesitant. A string instrument's pitch is determined by the tightness of the strings, which oftentimes leads to slight deviations in tune. Many players choose to use a tuner to correct it. Of course, some professionals with a fixed understanding of pitch can simply discern this with their own ears. This is known as having perfect pitch. Now that you think about pitch and musicality when you were learning violin before. When I first started learning how to play the violin, my teacher told me about a method to focus on your hearing, concentrating your. Senses to determine the pitch. Suddenly, an intriguing idea pops into your head. Why don't we give it a try? Yatte miru? Mani oda? You walk over and take the cello and bow from Artem. He doesn't know what's going on, but he still cooperates. You turn off the projector and ceiling lights. You then move over to the sofa. Pick up Atom's thigh he took off when he was changing and walk behind him. You then blindfold him with a tie. Without his sense of sight, Atom instinctually resists and wiggles around. <coughs> Didn't I tell you? Concentrate your senses and focus on your hearing. He looks somewhat nervous and his breathing quickens. He is like a lost traveler, suddenly swallowed up in the darkness of an unfamiliar world. つまり、これも練習の一環だと You don't respond. Only when he can't wait any longer and starts to turn to look for you, do you lean close to his ear and whisper softly. Can you really not see? His Adam's apple bobs as he swallows, but he puts on a calm facade. Let's begin then. You open a piano emulator app on your phone and play a chord. Atom looks a bit confused, like he doesn't understand how to concentrate his senses. With only his sense of hearing remaining, he is somewhat disoriented. Even though he says this, he still doesn't admit defeat. It looks like he's thinking hard to distinguish the pitch. You play the notes in the chord one by one. He seems to understand more clearly this time, and he notes faintly. Just name all of the notes in the chord, but that's not all. You have to sing them too. He furrows his brow slightly, his expression a little uncertain. You play it once more. He is completely concentrated as he listens, like he is beginning to recognize his own approach. Do, mi, fa, so, le. I'll give you one more chance. Are you sure it's D? Ah, so that. You're right, but for the next one, I'm not going to play each note separately. Ah. 
Maybe answering the first question correctly boosted his confidence because his next two answers are both totally right. Did I pick cards that were too simple? You chose some discord discordant combinations, missing in even more notes in an effort to purposefully mess with him. But he grows increasingly relaxed. After only listening once, he is able to answer without hesitation as he hums the correct notes gently. In contrast, even as the person asking the questions, you are a little confused. You don't know how to stump him. You match your fingers down to play a chord, but there are so many notes that you can't even remember the right answer. That one doesn't count. Atom smiles at your little trick. He then reaches up to remove the tie from his eyes. So, is this what you consider amateur? アプリの音源に調整の誤差はないからな。集中して聞き分ければそこまで難しくはない。Okay, okay, the test is over. 音階も大事だが、実際の演奏はまた難易度の種類が違う。手の位置や弦の張り具合、それこそ持ち方一つで音が狂ってしまうからな。だから、さっきので何度正解しようと、実践だの練習に勝ることはない。Atom reaches up to straighten out his collar. He then moves closer to you, blanketing you in his warm breath like gentle shackles. He holds the tie in both hands. His face still somewhat flushed as he pretends to cover your eyes. He seemingly saw through what you were trying to do by teasing him, so he takes this as an opportunity. At this point, you have no choice but to prepare yourself and answer Atom silently. But the darkness you are expecting never comes. Confused, you look up to welcome a sudden soft kiss. And that's how your first night practice session concluded, devoid of any substantial practice. Atom's home teacher. Over the next few days, you and Atom sort through information about the orphanage and practice for the concert. Even though the various evidence is detailed and complex, you're used to this kind of work. On the other hand, your and Atom's practice sessions does, doesn't go as smoothly as you once imagined. Ah, oh, sorry, I came in at the wrong time again. After talking it over, you and Artem narrow your performance down to six pieces. The first five songs are all relaxed and happy. As for the last piece, you want the children to feel the charm of a classic, so you choose a more difficult song. Carnival Fantasia is a waltz in D major that is considered a touchstone for musicians. The song you or Atom will be playing is adapted from this piece. It tells the story of a turning point in love. The first half is warm and soft, melodious, melodious and relaxing, while the second half is intense and passionate, filled with exuberant rhythm. In addition to the higher level skill like vibrato and spiccato, there are also intermittent rests between the notes, requiring you to individually master the rhythm to blend everything. Perfectly. The piece typically has a piano accompaniment and a conductor, but since it's just you and Artem playing, you have to rely on a perfect grasp of the piece and a tacit understanding of each other. You clearly already know how to play this part super well, but I always. This is the you nod and adjust your posture as you're about to raise your bow. Atom's phones receive a call that interrupts you. He glances at the caller ID. Yoshimo-san. 
Okay, I'll wait for you. You look over the sheet music again while you wait. 10 minutes later, Autumn finishes the call. This must be thought for Director Chen. He's already so busy taking care of the kids at the orphanage. And now he has to worry about the concert and seeking compensation too. さよい、裁判の方は順調にいっているようだ。手がかりの整理が終わり次第、すぐ告訴に移ろう。Yeah, it's up to us now. Come on, let's use this time to practice a bit more. You enthusiastically stand up, but Atom just smiles, shakes his head, and closes the music score. Today,もう遅い。続きは明日にしよう。明日は休みだから、他に予定がないなら、一日練習に当てられるはずだ。you're strict with yourself, but you always give me so much leeway. He tries to act like a strict teacher, but he smiles when his kiss meets yours. He places a kiss on the side of your neck, which you find vaguely comforting. Okay, but we Okay, but we need to keep up our momentum and start practicing first thing tomorrow morning. <laughs> However, as you and Atom begin putting away your instruments and get ready to relax, the director calls once again. You lean over in front of Atom and listen what he with him. The director discovered some new evidence which is very complicated but essential for the appeal. After hanging up, Atom has seemingly already guessed what you are going to say. He simply looks at you warmly. I want to deal with it tonight so we can focus on practicing tomorrow. Ah, so sure. You and Atom stay up all night to avoid delaying your progress. You finally finish early in the morning and head to bed. Atom's residence. A couple of hours after you start practicing the next day, you realize a deep philo philosophical truth of life. Staying up late and waking up early are the eternal enemies of humankind. Seeing that you're sleepy, Atom suggests that you take a break. You stop trying to put on a brief face, falling right onto the sofa in the first floor living room. <laughs> You yawn and nod, willing yourself to fight against your exhaustion. I'm, I'm just going to rest for another 30 seconds. Atom laughs softly in your ear as he gently rubs your hair. This soothing sensation only serves to make you more tired. You open your eyes and pull on Atom's collar. Didn't you say you were going to be stricter? Why are you making excuses for me again? And we stayed up all night together. Perhaps you made a really good point because Atom can't find an excuse to coddle you. He looks at you with a tender gaze. Unfortunately, he can't take away your sleepiness. Kunkainoongakaiwa I know, it's just you don't have much time, so you can only sacrifice some of your break time. Before you can even vocalize your worry, Artem places another document in your hand. What? 
最近君の仕事は煩雑だからなあらかじめ整理しておけば少しは楽になるだろう You look over Artem's plan carefully. He sorted through all the sporadic times and organized everything so it is cohesive and orderly. So, this is the magic of time management. No wonder you can juggle so many things in a short period of time. Donna Kotonimo, you send Juni, you are a carna. Daisina Yojo, you send Techni Kumikomi. I touch a conde, so Renga, you s h o r i s u r t a k a Atom has a particularly enticing charm as he gently explains his clear logic. Kyusok Jikan will kezer koto bakari kanga te tara, Izre kokoro ni yoyu ga nakunate, Akujun kan ni ochi te shimau takeda. Watashi mo tote kita michita kara yeru ga, Jisai, so koma de muzukashi koto de wanai. Doda? Skoshi wa natok de kita ka? Of course. You rub your arms around his neck and place a soft kiss on the side of his neck. He probably wasn't expecting you to be so grateful because his ears soon turned red. It's like you shattered his absolute rationality. とにかく、まずは休むことだ。10分後に再開しよう。You nod and lay in his arms, immersed in his warmth, you fall asleep. Atom's residence. You're unsure if it's because Atom urged you to go to bed early last night or that you're still somewhat nervous. But on the day of the performance, you wake up before your alarm even goes off. You walk into the living room to find Atom systematically getting everything ready. You force a smile, trying not to let your anxiety and stress rub off on him. Atom hands you a cup of coffee, saying through your act right away. I'm just. Say, go no gaso part of a huanaka? Yeah. There are no major issues other than the section with intermittent rest that puts your sense of rhythm to the test. Sometimes you just find it hard to sing perfectly with Artem. Suspected, performing in front of others isn't easy. I'm worried I'll notice everyone staring at me when I get on stage. If I get even more nervous, it will be easier for me to make a mistake. What if the situation on stage is. You don't enjoy these negative feelings. You are keenly aware that this anxiety and pressure will only make things worse, but you can't control it. But this concert is really important to you. So many people have put thoughtful effort into it. You don't want to ruin it. Does my feeling like this make you unhappy too? Atom shakes his head and hugs you, and you turn into his chest. You can hear his heart beating, firm and strong. It's like your hearts are right next to one another. Masaka, Kimi a juven yoku ya te ryu. Ato wa jisai ni yatte mite, jishin wo tsukeru dake da. Atom pats your shoulder softly. There is nothing vague about his touch. It feels like the simplest act of encouragement and acknowledgement when you first started working together. It gives you a gentle yet dependable strength. He takes your hand, touching your palm delicately as he speaks. The feeling is so nice that even your strained emotions begin to relax somewhat. You can always calm me down like this. In your eyes, do I not have a single flaw? He looks like he's earnestly considering it, like he's trying to recall something. You don't have to worry about your ability to do your own ability. That's why you do it. 
You know he's deliberately teasing you, but you don't want to refute him. You lazily rest your head on his shoulder, interlacing your fingers with his as he continues to rub your palms. Great, it helps you realize. How does it work? ここ数日の練習で手の筋肉も凝っていただろうからな。ビサッドハンス、can Yes, please. You lay down on the soft cushions on the living room couch, feeling surprised and excited to experience Atom's massage skills. He starts by rubbing your earlobes. After you slowly begin to relax, he begins massaging the acupuncture points of your head and the back of your neck. You can press a little harder. He uses a little more force for a moment, but his touch becomes gentle again after some time. It's more of a reassuring caress than a massage, but it certainly cures your nervousness. I'm feeling much better already. You've been so busy working and practicing recently, but I haven't been able to do anything for you. I actually made you worry more. Like a massage? I remember something similar from when I was a little. Even though it was pretty childish and I don't know where the adults got it from. Whenever I was nervous, they would say in my ear. Atom's gaze is sincere, filled with confusion and anticipation as he looks at you. You can't refuse to answer him, but you're still a little shy. You reach up to cover his eyes, lean close to his ear, and recite the encouraging spell from when you were little. You're the best, you're the best, you're the best. He is astonished for a few seconds, but he then begins to chuckle. When I got older, my parents weren't around much since they were so busy with work, so I haven't heard it in a long time. When you see this, you feel a sudden sense of disappointment. The people who once encouraged you have already drifted off. It seems like the time when you could be childish has already vanished. Atom suddenly leans over, his lips softly brushing against your ear. The most loving whisper carries the most firm encouragement. Somewhere in your heart becomes tender, as if a gust of wind is blowing past your nose, bringing with it a slight bitterness. But this bitterness finally gives way to warmth, like a beam of light piercing through the fog, the sun peeking through the clouds and illuminating everything below. With this one sentence, all of your worries and stress are swept away. You have to say it three times. <sighs> Just then, Atom's alarms ring. It's time for you two to leave. He stands up first, subsequently bending down and giving you a gentle hug. Yes, let's, let's face it together. Concept preparation area. 
When you and Atom get to the concert, you are shocked by the amount of people and the size of the venue. What? Why are there so many cameras here? And there are TV reporters too? Faced with this massive event, your heart, which took so long to calm down, becomes flustered once more. Before you can look at Atom for help, you are already being led to the lounge area by some volunteers to have your makeup done. After your hair and makeup are finished, Atom is waiting at the door for, your, for you with a resigned smile. Zaizen, People come and go all around you, and the boy's stress atmosphere only makes you feel more anxious. Suddenly, you are enveloped by a soft shadow. You look up to meet Artem's gaze. He turns his back to the beautiful sea of flowers and nods at you faintly. Thanks to the silent understanding between you two, he knows exactly what you are thinking. Look, here. At the concert. You look in the direction Artem is pointing to to find infinite tiny surprises hidden in this intoxicating sea of flowers. A handmade garland hangs on a blooming banyan tree, origami cranes on the branches rustle in the wind, embodying simple yet earnest wishes. There are handmade stuffed animals placed on every seat as well. Some of the handiwork is a bit rough, but the clunky aspect evokes a certain cuteness. Did the kids... You look at the thoughtful, detailed decorations, and it's almost like you can see the kids having fun making everything. Kalidawamina,yasashkumonokarinoikodomotashida.自分たちの努力や願いに真剣に向き合ってくれる人間がいるのだと知ってもらうことだろう。彼らが望んでいるのはプロによる演奏ではなく、約束を守ってくれる世の中があるという事実だ。A できるだけ前向きに望んでほしい。自分たちの願いが誰かを苦しめているなどとは。子供たちも思いたくはないだろうからな。in a corner where no one can see you too, Artem gently lifts your finger as if he is making a small promise to you. Taking in the aroma of the flower field, you march out on stage. The young faces of the kids amidst the audience are particularly clear and their heartfelt kisses empower you with a determined strength. As you reach up, you bow gently kisses the strings of your violin. A soft breeze blows through the flower field. It's as if the flowers are singing the first note and the joyful melody is carried far, far away on the wind. You've visualized this moment so many times, but now you realize it's more beautiful than you ever could have imagined. The lovely notes at your fingertips don't only represent the memories of practicing, nor are they simple melodies. They are a gift and blessing from you and Artem as you attempt to warm the innocent hearts of the children. These kids, who are never treated with tenderness, yet still have expectations for this world, they are the stars of this concert. The first five pieces go by nearly perfectly in the blink of an eye. All that remains is the final challenge. Now I just need to get through this with no mistakes and everything will be done. The second melody of the waltz begins, which is the section with intermittent rest, the part you often mess up during practice. You count four bits of rest in your head, however, at that very moment, a camera lens shifts and reflects the dazzling sunlight into your eyes. You inevitably turn your head to the side, ruining your posture and letting out a note early. 
you try your best to remain calm. Instead of moving your bow from the string in a panic, you attempt to gently ascend the note. Atom responds to you with his deep compost kiss. It is like the calm eye of a raging storm, instantly soothing your emotions. Time seems to freeze at this moment. When your eyes meet, everything he said when you two practice together clearly rings out in your mind. Pro no Kokyo Gakudan de Aroto, and so to New Yuxen Jitai Ni Ochi Koto Ar. どう頑張っても防げないならいっそのことをサプライズに変えてしまえばいいミスをした時は切り替えてお客さんに気づかれないよう演奏に戻ることだけ意識してみてくれそもそも私たちはプロとしての腕を試されているわけじゃないからな型にはめようとせず流れに沿って演奏を楽しめば極論ミスなんてものは生まれないんだ。That's right. This is your and Autumn's waltz. It belongs only to you and him. You continue the incorrect ascended note, improvising a mellow solo. Autumn notes tacitly, and the melody of his cello softly changes, blending in with your notes. With Atom's harmony, you slowly find your way back to the concert melody. With Atom's silent cooperation, you both get back on track and get past the section full of intermittent rest. You breathe a sigh of relief and look at the audience, feeling nervous. It looks like no one noticed the slight alteration you made just now. With the crisis averted, the final beats of panic and unease lingering in your heart vanish. Autumn is right. I was putting too much pressure on myself. It's clear that the one who makes me feel most relaxed is the person next to me. You close your eyes, allowing yourself to become immersed in the joy and warmth between notes. The interwoven melodies tie your and Autumn's emotions together. Right, there is nothing to worry about. He will always be there for you. The performance comes to a successful close. You and Atom take your final bow as the audience cheers and applauds widely. You then head back to the lounge area behind the stage. Phew, I almost messed up just then, but did you really understand what I was trying to say with just one look? Ishin Denshin to you yatsuka mo shire nai na. Kimi no omoi egaku yansou ni natta yo de, watashi mo ureshii yo. Nani yori, in, the f in fact, your performance just now was more perfect than any of the times you played in during practice. It's a beautiful memory worthy of remembering for a lifetime. I was overthinking things and ended up constraining myself. I didn't want all of the kids' work to be for nothing and ended up letting their expectations bring me down. 私たちの演奏はあくまで最後の演目に過ぎず重要なのは子供たちが協力して開催したこの会自体の方だ私たちの仕事はそれを締めくくることで幸いにも成功した Yeah and we did it together in this happy, beautiful moment, you were nothing more than to leap into Artem's arms. However, a childlike voice sounds from behind you before you can. Mina! Kochi! <coughs> you and Artem are surrounded by smiling faces in the blink of an eye, and he is clearly at a loss. You smile even bigger after seeing his embarrassed expression. Oni-chan! Oni-chan! We're at tennis. Bengoshi? Nani sore? Kako ide? Soreja, but as you know, Tonani not that a Bengoshi not the Anita does to Ishani on the Kayare. 
for a moment you're unsure if you should clarify this beautiful misunderstanding. When you look at Artem, you spot a few small figures staring at you too but unwilling to get close. まだまだ大変なことが待ち受けているかもしれないが、少なくともこの絵には彼らを見ている大人たちがいると分かってもらえただろう。You know, although there is a hint of sadness in your heart, satisfaction always is. Your effort has indeed helped these kids. At this moment, you are extremely grateful for the choice you made. The kids chat noisily for a while before they are quickly ushered back to the orphanage by volunteers. You and Artem put away your instruments and get ready to return to the audience seating area to relax. Artem, thank you. I definitely couldn't have done this alone. <laughs> At a concert. When you and Atom get to the seating area, you see Director Chen walking toward you before you even find a place to sit. Honto,素晴らしい演奏でした。子供たちがあんなに幸せそうな顔を見せたのはいつぶりでしょうか。it was our pleasure, Director Chen. 当然のことをしたまでです。それで賠償請求についてですが、すでに証拠の整理が終わり、相手側との交渉段階に移っています。結果もすぐに出るでしょう。本当ですか。何から何まで本当にありがとうございます。Director Chen holds your and Artem's hand tightly, repeatedly thanking you. He only reluctantly leaves after several reporters begin flocking to him in hopes for getting an interview. As you watch Director Chen's receding figure, you breathe a long sigh of relief. The dust has settled, making way for a happy ending. So, no video? Video? You quickly move over to watch the video of your and Artem's performance. Ah, oh, why I'm why are my eyes closed for so many of these shots? In the video, you are immersed in the performance. It's like you completely forgot how to control your expression as you watch your face turn shred. Television. Before you can ask any more questions, Celestine is called away by a staff member. Atom leads you to a more private place to sit down. I would have reined in my performance a little if I knew it was going to be on TV. Why were you looking at me the whole time instead of the audience? As if he is making a solemn promise or oath, his kiss is sincere and warm. You want to tell him that he isn't the only one whose heart beats every time you see one another. No matter what, our hard work wasn't for nothing. After we head back today, let's celebrate. Ah, just then, Director Chen begins his speech on stage. The crowd bursts into applause as Atom gently takes your hand. Atom's home theater.
you and Atom head back to the home theater at his house after the concert. What did you prepare? Are you hiding it in here? Atom takes a wooden box out from under the coffee table before sitting down next to you. He gently hands the wooden box to you, and you can instantly smell the scent and feel the way of the fancy wood. This gift is much more serious than you'd imagine. This is... As you open the wooden box, you find a brand new bowl lying inside. The wood is a deep scarlet, warm and exquisite, while the pure white bow hair is both lustrous and pliable. A calf rose adorns the end of the bowl. この世に一つしかない永遠の花だ。今回の件で私が一番嬉しかったことは演奏している君の姿を見られたことだ。今日という特別な一日も君と合奏してきた一分一秒も私は決して忘れることはないだろう。君が次にいつ演奏してくれる
However, you remain close to one another amidst these quiet, dark nights. Just like the heartfelt feelings between you two, there is no need for any distance. もう昼だが、何してるんふてね<笑>気持ちよさそうで、さすがに、起こせなかった。今は、アンジェル学園近くの、前に、一緒に歩いた路地にいる。チャリティーイベントが成功して、福祉施設への関心が高まったんだ。その結果、多額の寄付金が届き、吉野さんから追加の依頼が入ったんだ。ああ、寄付だからこそ、法規的な保護が必要になる。結局のところ、無償の愛ほど純粋で尊いものはない。実は、施設の子供たちがお礼にと、プレゼントをくれたんだ。ああ、家に帰ったら、この喜びを君と分かち合いたい。そうだ、もうすぐ終わるから、明るいうちに少し歩かないか来る途中、前に話してた店の前を通ったら、新作が出てたんだ。それでつい予約を<笑>入れてしまってな。すまないが、一緒に行ってくれ。それか、私が今から買って、後で届けに行ってもいい。わ<笑>かった。家まで迎えに行こう。ああ、その他に欲しいものはないか。うん、そうか。私も楽しみだ